Hello and <clears throat> welcome back to Let's Play Shadows Awakening. Awakening. With me, Demox. I'm not sure why I lower my voice at that point. That's what the voice thing's for. Anyway, when we last left off, we did something with the moons. The great honor or something, and we did some. I think you can get a more better result if you get all four totems. I haven't got the puzzle result yet for all four totems. Oh, what's this one? Hidden Fortress Gate. Ah, there's two ways in. Either blow up the gate, redirect, smash the door in approach, or we take the sneaky approach and we go in the back door. And thus remove their ability to flee. Because no one in the right mind is going to stay around and fight me when I come running through the door. How very disappointing. But yeah, wait. Just actually for a point of reference here. Because of her stats, kind of stats. These guys get um bone magic skill damage bonus, so they they've generated twenty percent extra damage from this, because the class of mage main attribute is willpower. Now her damage Yeah, weapon base, dark strength bonus. Don't do much. Her skill damage on the other hand Oh karma. Cruelty. The souls is just swallowed. Charity. Cool, I didn't even know there was a thing. Hmm. What it means to offer charity? Uh, no, we just help people go get rewards, to be perfectly honest. I can't really say it's like, I learned to be charitable, and kind, and sweet, and honourable. No, I just blow things up and I get points for it, I get, um, uh, paid for it. Like that. I want charitable. I'm gonna need to slay a lot. Yeah, little well, icons to slay. Somewhere around. Ooh, all safe kicked in. You fight me now. I am Ron Elemental. That went worse than I thought. Doesn't mean you're messing so. Which um uh suits me just stucky. Huh. A low quality bear mask. Right, looks like it's um off to the hidden place for us then. I mean, we got to the moon thing, and that went did its thing. Don't know why it did its thing, but it did anyway. Oh, actually, no, hold on. Hold the phone. I saw some. I saw the nook back here. Got the points heavier for heavier. Be they wolf or demon, doesn't matter. The fate of the world rests on your shoulders. What's that mean? It means we're not being prejudicial. You are potentially going to save the world. That's all we need to know. Ah. None of these things. So this has got a wolf. Now the 
tongue sticking out, so... This is how I do it. It's a statue. Can you turn that? I should really realize that it was, you know, asking me to turn the dials to match the thing on the floor. You are fine. And open the doors! Yay! Time to claim some more points. We have now indeed dealt with everything in here. I'll run up here, round here, into the fortress, wipe everybody out, come out, and say, hey, look at those, we're heroes. There was something similar to Morian Camp. And now that I know where the puzzle solution is hidden, and I have to go back to Brooklyn Sphere Pass anyway to pick up the um, uh, scepter part. This is no longer well out of my reach because we are now a level 14 person trying to pick a fight with them. It is for level 16 but we are only two levels lower now. And not the uh, significantly lower. Score of 12. That would not have been a good fight. I like those species around here. Species? Experience? Points? Now. Game, you fail me. Nope, on there. Doopy 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 doo. So through here. Sort out. Open. And this door does not appear unless you're in this form. If you're in this form, it's a solid wall, where they bricked it off. But this, in this point, it remembers where there was no gate there. Oh, 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 oh. One step closer. Yeah. If you surrender, I promise a fair trial. Don't say I didn't give you a chance. Unless they've got a load of undead and the berserkers who are protected by wolf spirits. They will not succeed. Surrender, I will give you a chance. Wait. 
before you can get the thing to hold. Yep, and a whole heap load of points too. Turn back to there just in just in time for that to strike. Hit. Hit Actually, we have skills. Yep, we have skills. We want to try him out. Uh, Packness is very, very useful. He's at level 3. Dealing a lot of damage. Blade Dancer, though. That's 290. That starts at 100, so. But interval. We will increase damage intervals. We'll try that on this and see what it's like. That actually works pretty nicely. We're just gonna wipe you all out. The fact that he only walked through, pull the switch, and then walk through. Get off in the lava. Burn, wolf boy, burn. He sounds human humanoids. We can take a berserker, which means we do a lot more damage. We take more damage back. Likely more. Well, A is a nice big shelf, I believe. But there's likely a lot of things in here. But never mind, could we do it at night? Like, I think that's the main entrance you would come in if you came in via the normal door. Longer and Zara would have finished him off. Zara hits fast. Well, for a warrior, Zara hits really, really, really fast. Myself. So we're supposed to do something on this piece of pattern wise or something? It's not like a pattern to go all the way across, so I'm thinking that Ah, so we'll roll stone. Okay. Spot your duck out here. Well, that one. Oh, maybe we got to press them both at the same time. God, this puzzle is annoying. Very annoying puzzle. Okay, so he is on that one, so I want to be stood on this one. I 
shall show thee true power. I feel like there's something missing here because he's sat on that rock, so maybe there's a combination we need. Or to know which symbol to push down. My goal, my sangle, like, got better and better looking. Well, I'm gonna say I didn't warn you. Try to give you a fair trial. We are getting quite a bit good chunk of head XP for this. Shadow forms get down there. You don't hit anyone near as hard as I do. Proven point. Case in point there. If you did, I want to just absolutely blitz you. I'd rather have like a game XP for this. And I get power for my shards. Already dead. Well, the shadow merchant's there, which is nice to see. Alright, so look at the map. There's this bit up here. Shadow mode? Yeah, that's connected that way. There's to main hall. Okay, there's definitely some sort of puzzle or script I need to press in order to get that. Also. Health. You're a fool. Because I blitz you in like two seconds. Ooh, skill point. Yeah, Shadow Stone. Well, look for the points. Not even leveling up, but he's using the points 
anyway, so it's as if I le have leveled up. Chest. A rogue mask. Ooh. Ushak has that one. And that's a pretty nice piece of gear. I like that. You know what? I'll upgrade a flame strike. She now it now deals 180 damage. I mean this does blunt damage for 440, so. Uh, Zar's got plenty of points but not enough yet for his pack master, which is what I want to be honest. Or any of those skills to be perfectly frank. Venom Breath needs more points. I'm tempted to spend points on Rolling Stone. But, actually, yeah, I'm going to be another two levels when I get Venom up. I mean, it does. If you go against something that's not immune to poison or high resistant to poison, his poison damage, poison breath, is absolutely destructive. And he's just destructive all over for. Plain destructive. Yeah, it's gonna be a few. Hmm. Shadow Tentacles won't be around for four more levels. Save for soldering. All these cases are the case of I have to wait for them to level up. Whee! So we have a new mask for Ushak. Despair. Nice. Huh. Ah, we can probably leave on that side to open the door. Open it up. I thought one of those cases where I could walk across as a shadow. Turns out no. So he essentially sees the world as it was. Puts it. The shadows remember what they used to be. And there's a few more bits here and there to talk to, go to. That's all for next time. So until then, do folks. Until then, I'm going to do then. Yeah. my dudes. Until then, my dudes. Until then, I'll catch you all later. See ya.